This is David Jacobs speaking to you from the Concert Hall of the Rye Television Centre in Naples. As the audience here awaits the start of the programme, they're joined by over 150 million viewers throughout Europe. For not only are the 18 countries watching this programme, the 18 countries represented, but for the first time, the song contest will be seen in Czechoslovakia, Poland, Hungary, East Germany and Russia. The Italian television service plays host to us for the first time in this city, famed for its singers and songs, because last year little Giulia Le Cinquenti won the contest with her song Non Ola Ta Per As the program progresses, I'll do my best to tell you in as few words as possible what the songs are all about. But in a moment, you'll meet our comer for the evening, young actress Renato Maro. But first, to conduct the Rye Concert Orchestra, we welcome the local conductor Gianni Ferio. Renata Mayaro. Signore e signori, buonasera. Il mio saluto vi giunge da Napoli, la città che ospita questa sera la decima edizione del Gran Premio Eurovisione della Canzone. 18 nazioni si batteranno per il primato. Esse sono l'Olanda, l'Inghilterra, la Spagna, l'Irlanda, la Germania, l'Austria, la Norvegia, il Belgio, il Principato di Monaco, la Svezia, la Francia, il Portogallo, l'Italia, la Danimarca, il Lussemburgo, la Finlandia, la Jugoslavia e la Svizzera. L'ordine di presentazione delle canzoni è stato affidato al sorteggio. Le votazioni avverranno secondo un regolamento che in seguito vi comunicheremo. L'orchestra della RAI accompagnerà i cantanti che si avvicenderanno davanti alle telecamere. Mesdames, Mesdemoiselles, Messieurs, bonsoir. Mon salut vous arrive de Naples, qui accueille ce soir la dixième représentation du Grand Prix européen de la chanson. Dix-huit nations entreront en compétition pour gagner le premier prix. Elles sont la Hollande, l'Angleterre, l'Espagne, l'Irlande, l'Allemagne, l'Autriche, la Norvège, la Belgique, la Principauté de Monaco, la Suède, la France, le Portugal, l'Italie, le Danemark, le Luxembourg, la Finlande, la Yougoslavie et la Suisse. L'ordre de présentation des chansons a été tiré au sort et les votations seront exécutées selon un règlement dont vous nous ferons part ensuite. L'orchestre de la RAI accompagnera les chanteurs qui se présenteront devant, devant les caméras. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Welcome with us to Naples for the 10th edition of the Eurovision Song Contest. 18 countries have entered their songs for this year's contest. They are Holland, Great Britain, Spain, Ireland, Germany, Austria, Norway, Belgium, Monaco, Sweden, France, Portugal, Italy, Denmark, Luxembourg, Finland, Yugoslavia and Switzerland. The order of presentation has been drawn by the European Broadcasting Union and the voting will take place according to rules that will be explained to you later. The singers will be accompanied by the Rai Orchestra. And now again, welcome to Naples. You can see that the Great Britain song, Kathy Kirby song, is drawn to number two. The first one out of the box is from the Netherlands. The Netherlands have already won twice in 1957 and 1959. The song is called It is Genoch. It is Enough. It's about a girl who's had enough of being made tired by her lover for too long. She says they have played with fire. So let's start anew. For, as she says, it is enough. 
The orchestra is conducted by Dolph Santa Linden, a very well-known figure in the Eurovision Song Contest and certainly no stranger to our radio listeners in Great Britain. And now we meet the singer, Connie Van den Bos. Screens, you can now see the British supporters sitting there. And now the British supporters have probably been shown quite by chance that we are going to hear Renato Moiro introduce our song. I think we all know the song, so let's hear how it's introduced in Italian. Una donna ascolta il proprio cuore che le sussurra. Questa volta non è come le altre volte. Questo non è un amore qualunque. Oggi so che tutti i miei sogni sono possibili perché appartengo a lui. I belong. Io appartengo. Dirige l'orchestra il maestro Eric Robinson. Canta Kathy Kirby. One more love 
see what the rest of the opposition is like. We go to Spain with a song called Que Bueno, Que Bueno, How Good, How Good. Like the British song, I belong, this too tells a happy story. When we're apart, the hours seem like centuries, the day is eternity. But when we're together, time goes flying by. The orchestra is conducted by Adolfo Ventas Rodriguez. Adolfo Ventas. Adolfo Ventas Rodriguez. And now the singer Canta Conchita Bautista. Entry, que bueno, que bueno. 
And now we welcome into the Eurovision Song Contest for the very first time a singer from ERA. The singer is Butch Moore, a 22-year-old Dubliner, who in fact was a lead singer with the Capital Show Band, with whom he's toured America and has appeared at the London Palladium. The song is written by Theresa Conlon, George Prendergast, and Joe Mulligan. The orchestra is conducted by I'm the local conductor, Gianno Ferio. Dirige l'orchestra il maestro Gianni Ferio. Have you heard? The title of the song is I'm Walking the Streets in the Rain, and here to sing it is Butch Moore. to the song from Germany, Paradis, Wo bist du? Paradise, where are you? This will be sung by a girl called Ulla Weisner, who is a member of the Gunther Kalman Chorale. This is another story of young love. Sometimes the girl says she thinks she is in paradise, then she gets let down, so she stands and weeps like a little girl lost in the town. Paradise, where are you? The orchestra is conducted by Alfred Hauser. Here is the singer, Kanta Ulla Weissner. Ulla Wiesner. Ich bin 
Dirige l'orchestra il maestro Erwind Berg. And the singer, who are the lead singers with the Swedish Park Touring Group, Rothana, Kirsti Sparbo. Norway. And now to the song from Belgium, When Spring Comes Back. The singer in this particular song waits in vain for her lover, and even though she knows he won't come to her, every spring she touches the dew and counts the April stars, always hoping. It's written by Jacques Dressen and Yif van der Berg, and this orchestra, again, the Rye Concert Orchestra, is conducted by Gaston Neut. And the singer who has been in many song festivals in Europe, in London, San Remo, and Knock, is Lisa Marta. Ik spaar de druppels van de dauw, als 
That is Lisa Marker with the song from Belgium when spring comes back. Now to Monaco, who came third last year. This song of theirs, Go and Tell Love, is really the song of a 17-year-old girl who actually asks love itself to tell the man of her dreams, whom she doesn't really know, that she is waiting, thinking, dreaming and hoping. The song is written by Jacques Murray and Raymond Bernard. And the conductor of the orchestra is one of the composers, Raymond Bernard. And to sing the song is the girl who might well with her face sway one or two votes, Marjorie Noel. Je l'attends, je l'attends Et qu'il pense à moi longtemps Margie Noel with the song from Monte Carlo Go and Tell Love And now to song number 10, which is from Sweden. It's sung by Ingvar Vixel, and it's called Absent Friends. I went to a lot of trouble to get the English translation of this particular song, which is really another song of spring, only to find that for reasons best known to the Swedish team, the song is going to be sung in English. It does appear in French. In fact, that records in Sweden sell more in English than in any other language. Here's the conductor, William Lind. And you ought to smile and look at me, and I ought to kiss you tenderly. But I don't know if you still are mine, this love of spring. I wish I knew where you are. 
Wonderful with the song from Sweden, Absent Friend. And now to the song from France. France has already won the Eurovision Song Contest three times in 1958, 60 and 62. This is a very unusual thought for a Frenchman, this song, Never Tell Her. It is, if you want to have happiness in love, the man must be the one who baffles and sows doubt. And above all, he must never, never tell her that he loves her. It's written by François Dorin and Guy Mardel, and the orchestra is Frank Porcel. And to sing, n'avoue jamais, never tell her, is one of the heartthrobs of France who wrote the song, Guy Mardel. Mardel and the song from France, Never Jamais, Never Tell Her. And now to Portugal, who took part for the first time last year. Their song is Sol de Inverno, Winter Sun. This song is again about lost love. I live in longing, my love. Life has lost its thunder. I feel like the winter sun, shining without warmth in a cold sky. The singer, whom we'll meet in a minute, was voted the 1964 Queen of Portuguese Radio. And now, here is the conductor, Fernando de Caravaggio. And now the singer, Simone de Oliveira. Sonhei onde estão Ora 
Tienes que vivir y estar. Que ser bater el corazón y no tener amor de ninguém. Vais buscar tu cuando estás. A quien foste de Falo mais de não ter coração do que ter e não ter como eu. Eu em troca de nada dei tudo na vida, bandeira vencida rasgada no chão. Sou a data esquecida, a coisa paradita que vai a Leila. Como o sol de inverno, não tenho calor. Well, a young lady, Simone de Oliveira, from Portugal, rightly crowned the 1964 Queen of Portuguese Radio with a voice like that. Now for the locals. This is where we're probably going to have quite a lot of excitement in the hall because it's a local song, a true piece of Italian romance. If you cry, if you smile, I will smile. If you cry, I will cry. I will be your mirror. You'll never be alone. I'll always be near you. Song, si piangi, si ridi. I said, if you cry, if you smile. We haven't yet seen the thing here at rehearsals. He's been off with a bad throat, I understand. But I hear he's here tonight to conduct the orchestra. Gianni Ferio. Dirige l'orchestra il maestro Gianni Ferio. There's a much worked conductor tonight, Gianni Ferio. And now the singer, the heartthrob from Rome, Bobby Solo. Diretto da Nora Orlandi, Bobby Solo. Amore, io piango con te perché sono parte di te. Sorridi sempre, se tu non vuoi, non vuoi vedere soffrire mai. Io rido con te perché tu fai parte di me. Ricorda sempre quel che tu fai sopra il mio volto lo rivedrai. Non sei mai sola. Anche se tu, tu sei lontana da me, ogni 
Denmark, and this is called Because of You. This song is about a girl who is tired of being treated, strangely enough, as if she were delicate and coy by her lover. No longer, she says, will she be his prey. She wants to be his equal, for some strange reason, or because of you. Because of you is the title of this song, written by Paul Henningsen and Jürgen Jeschild. The conductor is a very well-known trumpet player and conductor, Arne Lambert. The singer is an actress in films and review, Birgit Brühl.
And now we go to Luxembourg, who tied for fourth place with France last year, but won the contest in 1961. The song from Luxembourg is Poupée de Cire, Poupée de Sang, a wax doll, singing doll. A wax singing doll whose heart is grooved into her songs, who knows nothing of boys, but who hopes one day to really live what she sings and no longer be afraid of life and love. The conductor is Alain Coraguier. And the singer, though representing Luxembourg, is actually a Parisienne, charming France Gall. And now to Finland. The figure of this song, when the sun is setting in the west, believed his love would last forever. He thought the sun of his happiness stood still in the sky. But as he saw the sunset, he realized the time of life, or rather of love, had passed away. The singer is a gentleman from Helsinki who has Cossack blood in his veins. The conductor is George Dogodzinski. And the singer, whom I told you, is from Helsinki, played there in the Anthony Newry show, Stop the World. It's Victor Klimenko. Taivaani kirkasta ei, purppura pilvissä sousi, näyttymys unelmi. Nyt aurinko laskee länteen, saapunut ilta jo. Oh, 
From Finland, we go on to Yugoslavia. The singer of the Yugoslavian song The Longing, Vitsi Bukov, was uh, in the Eurovision Song Contest in London in 1963. This song, The Longing, is again the story of longing, loving, and hoping. But this time, the young man pleads to the sea to tell him what he wants to hear, the answer, in fact, to his longing. The conductor is Radevich Spachi. And the singer, Vitsi Bukov. Vukov and the song from Yugoslavia, The Longing. And now we come to the last of the 18 countries represented, the last song from Switzerland, No, Without You Forever. This is the story of a girl who has lost her love, but actually for once admits that she will get over it. Because one morning, nothing, she says, will remain of you. The day will come with a new love, not you. The orchestra is conducted by Maro Robiani. And to sing the song for Switzerland is a young Greek singer, Giovanna. Giovanna. No, but 
perdu à n'avoir voulu que toi. The last of the 18 songs. And now Renata Marawa, hostess on tonight's show, is going to introduce the act who will entertain us for the next five minutes while the juries throughout the countries are deciding about their votes, counting up the numbers, and we'll be hearing from them later. The artist that you're about to see and hear is one of the most famous Italian opera singers. Mario del Monaco. He's going to sing two songs, Iste el Paese del Sol. This Mario is the country of Sun and Osola Mio. Singer, Mario del Monaco. Canterò due canzoni napoletane del vecchio stile. I love to sing for you uh, two Napoletan songs of old style. Je vais chanter deux chansons
Mario del Monaco with two Neapolitan songs. Now we go to Renato Maro, our hostess, who is going to tell you about uh, Mr. Vilcek, the EBU, the European Broadcast Union, scrutineer. I think she's going to do it in English after she's spoken in Italian and French. In case she doesn't, that's what the next few moments are going to be about. When Renato Maro, as I say, introduces Mr. Vilcek. But they're still applauding, quite rightly, Mario del Monaco. Still applauding him. He's on the stage, but we can't see him. He's taking many bars, and now he's gone off. Ed ora passiamo alla votazione. L'Unione Europea di Radiodiffusione ha nominato come scrutatore il signor Miroslav Vilcek. Capo della sua sezione Eurovisione per il Gran Premio Eurovisione della Canzone 1965. Egli controllerà i risultati che perverranno dalle diverse giurie nazionali. E maintenant, on passe au vote. L'Union Européenne de Radiodiffusion a désigné M. Miroslav Vilcek, chef de la section Eurovision, comme scrutateur du jury européen pour le Grand Prix Eurovision de la Chanson. Il contrôlera les résultats en provenance des différents jurys nationaux. And now we will proceed to the voting. The European Broadcasting Union has appointed Mr. Miroslav Vilcek, the head of its Eurovision section, as scrutineer of the European jury for the 1965 Song Contest. He will control and supervise the results of the vote that will be announced by the national juries. Can I proceed, Mr. Vilcek? This is where I'm going to tell you about the Hello. jury. Well, they haven't left me time to tell you about the voting. They were supposed to have given me 30 seconds to tell you about the voting, but I, I'll describe it if I can as it goes along. France, one point. Italy, three points. Italy, three points. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, five points. And that completes the voting of Netherlands jury. After the voting well, from Great Britain, thank you I'll very describe much, to you the system voting. of voting for this particular contest. Hello, Great Britain. Hello, Naples. London calling. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Here uh, are the results of the United Kingdom jury. Italy, yes. one point. Italy, one point. Austria, three points. Austria, three points. Monaco, five points. Monaco, five points. And that completes the voting of the United Kingdom jury. I thank you very much, United Kingdom. Each national jury has got ten members, each of whom has three votes, which can be awarded, or three votes to one song. Votes to one, one to another song, or one to each of the three songs. No abstentions are allowed, and the juries cannot vote for their own country's songs. The votes are added up, and the song with the most votes is awarded five points, the second, three points, and the third, one point. As you can hear, they are now receiving the results from Spain. Je m'excuse énormément, Madrid, mais soyez gentil et veuillez répéter encore très doucement, s'il vous plaît, parce qu'il faut que moi-même je répète vos votes. Alors, voulez-vous recommencer, s'il vous plaît? Je répète le résultat des jurys espagnols. Merci. Luxembourg, un point. Luxembourg, un point. France, trois points. France, trois points. Angleterre, cinq points. Angleterre, cinq points. Madrid, je vous remercie beaucoup et je m'excuse pour vous avoir fait répéter vos votes. Bonsoir, Madrid. Well, you can see that Luxembourg is just one point ahead of Monaco and Great Britain at the moment, who are... Place. Hello, Na Hello, Naples. Hello, Double Ireland. Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Well, I'm very pleased to talk to you. And would you pleased. Would you be kind and let us know how your jury has voted, please? Well, here are our results. France, one point. France, one point. Luxembourg, three points. 
Luxembourg, three points. Austria, five points. Austria, five points. Thank well, you, Renata Mara. Goodbye, Mara. Dublin. Goodbye, goodbye, Dublin, and thank you. Thank you. Well, unless anybody decides again it. Hello, the Germany. moment is Luxembourg out in front. Hello, Germany, can you hear me? Hello, hello, neighbors. Frankfurt yes? calling. Here are the results of the German jury. Yes. Italy, one point. Italy, one point. France, three points. France, three points. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, Five points. And that completes the voting of the German jury. Well, okay. not, uh, now that the British jury has not voted not and I won't be accused of swaying them, the hot favourite here in the British contingent at the moment is that Luxembourg, if we don't win, Luxembourg should walk away with it and walk away with it at the moment they are. Good evening, Austria. Would you uh, be kind and tell us how is your voting? With pleasure, this is Vienna calling, and here are the results of the Austrian jury. Norway, one point. Norway, one point. Switzerland, three points. Switzerland, three points. Luxembourg, five points. Luxembourg, and uh, that completes the voting of the Austrian jury. Good night, Naples. Good Luxembourg has taken itself right out in front there with, I think... 18 points at this particular moment. No, it's going out to 19 points. Do you hear me? Good evening, Renata. We do indeed. This Good is evening. Also calling. Here Good are e the results of the Norwegian jury. United uh, Kingdom, one point. United Kingdom, one point. Luxembourg, three points. Luxembourg, three points. The Netherlands, five points. The Netherlands, Holland, five points. And that completes the voting of the Norwegian jury. Thank you very much, Oslo, and goodbye. Good and night, you can Renata. see at the moment it's Luxembourg right out in front with France Hello, and Austria tying for second place and Great Britain for third. Voici les résultats du jury belge. Italy, trois points. Italy, trois points. Royaume-Uni, six points. Royaume-Uni, six points. Et ceci termine le vote du jury belge. Bonsoir, Naples. Bonsoir, well, six monsieur. points, Susie, Bonsoir, have been given to us. Merci beaucoup. Royaume-Uni, Great Britain. And that'll do us very nicely. It'll take us very nicely up there. It doesn't seem to be moving very fast, but I'm sure it'll get there in the end. Mr. Vilchik's got his eye on it. And so have I, let me tell you that. But it's not going to take Hello, us at the Monaco. moment in front of Luxembourg. Hello, Naples. Bonsoir, Naples. Bonsoir, Ici. Monaco. Ici, Monaco. Bonsoir. J'aimerais bien que vous me donniez les résultats. Voici les résultats du jury monégasque. Portugal, un point. Portugal, un point. Italie, trois points. Italie, trois points. France, cinq points. France, cinq points. Voilà, ceci termine le vote du jury monégasque. Bonsoir, Naples. Bonsoir, Monte Carlo, et merci mille fois. Merci. Luxembourg is still out in front, but Great Britain, you'll be delighted to know, is in second place. I think, unless Hello, that France Sweden. is tying Hello. for second place with us. Good evening, Stockholm. We are very anxious to know how the results of your voting. Yes. Here they are, the results of the Swedish jury. Luxembourg, one point. Luxembourg, one point. United Kingdom, three points. United Kingdom, three points. And Denmark, Five points. Denmark, five points. Yes, and that completes the voting of the Swedish jury. Thank you very much, Sweden. Well, there was no doubt Goodbye. about it. I was wrong before. France was leading in the second place, but Great Britain is now well out there, second to Luxembourg, Hello? who've got 22 points. Oui, Paris, bonsoir. Bonsoir, Na. Bonsoir, Inata. Bonsoir, merci. Je suis très curieuse de savoir comment a voté le jury français. Eh bien, voici exprimé par le jury français. Yougoslavie, un point. Yougoslavie, un point. Italie, trois points. Italie, trois points. Suisse, cinq points. Suisse, cinq points. 
Well, I have a point to Switzerland there hasn't altered the picture at all. It's still Luxembourg out in front of Great Britain. Au revoir, Paris. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir. Allo, le Portugal. Le scoreboard est russe. Voici les résultats du jury portugais. Yougoslavie, un point. Yougoslavie, un point. Irlande, trois points. Irlande, trois points. Autriche, cinq points. Autriche, cinq points. Et ceci termine le vote du jury portugais. Bonsoir, Naples. Bonsoir, Lisbonne, et merci beaucoup. Merci à vous. Well, we're going to have to need a couple more points if we're going to keep second place at the moment. We'll get back Hello, to the scoreboard, but we're still there in second place. Hello, Naples. Vous m'entendez? Oui, très bien. Ici, Naples, voici les résultats du jury italien. Oui. Royaume-Uni, un point. Pardon, soyez gentil, répétez, je n'ai pas très bien compris. Royaume-Uni, un point. point. Royaume-Uni, un point. Autriche, trois points. Autriche, trois points. Irlande, cinq points. Irlande, 5 points. Et ceci termine le vote du jury italien. Merci, Now, bonsoir. as you can see, Austria has come up to join us in second place. But Luxembourg still out there, but not getting the many votes that they were before. See. Hello, Denmark. Hello, Naples. Can you hear me? Yes, very good. Fine. Here are the results of the Danish jury. Luxembourg, one point. Luxembourg, one point. Sweden... Three points. Sweden, three points. United Kingdom, five points. United Kingdom, five points. Well, and that, that just about does the trick for us for the moment. Let's see how far that takes us up. It's difficult from here to read that scoreboard. It's probably easier for you. Going past the 20, 21. No, it's just 21 against Luxembourg's 24. Hello, Luxembourg. Hello. Oui, bonsoir, Naples. Ici, Luxembourg. Bonsoir, Luxembourg. Je suis très curieuse de savoir comment vous avez voté. Eh bien, voici les résultats du jury luxembourgeois. Italie, un point. Italie, un point. France, trois points. France, trois points. Danemark, cinq points. Danemark, cinq points. Ceci termine le vote du jury luxembourgeois. Merci beaucoup, Luxembourg. Au revoir. Three more ah. votes to come in, and still it's Luxembourg only now just in front of Great Britain. Hello, Finland. Little check, nods his head in approval. Hello, Finland. Can you hear me? Yes, Naples, we can hear you indeed. And they have oh, no votes in Oh, that's Finland. wonderful. Yes, isn't it? <laughs> well, we here are... are the results of the Finnish jury. Very yes. Very sad, because he's got no votes France, for Finland. France, one point. France, one point. Sweden, three points. Sweden, three points. Luxembourg, Aha. five points. That's Luxembourg, taken Luxembourg right out there points. in front now. And that completes the voting of the Finnish jury. Grazie, Napoli, e saluti di Helsinki. Grazie, Finnish jury. Very, very just, kind gesture from Finland who got no votes, but Everybody. they're not the only ones. Thank you because... very much. Goodbye. We're now going to hear from Yugoslavia and... Hello, la Yugoslavie. Hello, Yugoslavie. Vous m'entendez? I'm waiting. Hello, Hello Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia. Hello, Naples. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Here are the results of the Yugoslav jury. Monaco, one point. Monaco, one point. Monaco. Ireland, three points. Ireland, three points. Is he going to give it to Great Britain France, or Luxembourg? No. Five points. France, five points. And that completes the voting of the Yugoslav jury. Good evening, Naples, and thank you. Good evening, Zagreb. I think he's going to put France into second place. Yes, and leave us in third place at the moment. It really is a very close thing, but what's going to happen when we hear from, from the last country, Switzerland? Bonsoir, Voici le jury. résultat du jury suisse. Monaco, un point. Monaco, un point. Luxembourg, trois points. Ah, they've done it. Luxembourg, trois points. Royaume-Uni, cinq points. Royaume-Uni, cinq points. Oh, look at that. Le vote du jury suisse. Bonne note, Napoli. 
Buonanotte Zurigo e grazie. Good night and thank you. Isn't that absolutely incredible? Every year we seem to come second. 32 points to Luxembourg and 26 to Great Britain with 22 to France. But we still have to wait for Mr. Vilcek, the scrutineer, to tell us whether or not the score is as it looks on that board. But I don't think there's any doubt about it. Luxembourg has got the first prize with Wax Doll, Singing Doll, singing doll. or was it that little singer, France Gaulle, who captivated everybody, as did Giliola Cinquetta last year with her singing and, indeed, her face that we saw on the screen. Well, there comes Mr. Vilcek. Is he going to tell us that there's a mistake on the board? I somehow think not. We've been checking very carefully as it went along. But we shall hear from Renato Mauro, the complete result. internazionale ha dichiarato vincente il Lussemburgo. Well, Luxembourg has won, and once again, Great Britain takes second place. Serge Gainsbourg is being announced, the writer of the song Poupée de Tire, Poupée de Sang. Is he here, I wonder? Yes, he is. And they've asked Mario Del Monaco to present the silver medals. Now, Mario Del Monaco is there. I don't see the writer. I thought he was coming up, but he's not. <laughs> she's got enough papers there. I don't know what she's looking for, but uh, Serge Gainsbourg is the writer, if he's about. Second, she says, Lingolterra. Second, indeed, once again. And third, France. France Girl will be presented by Mario Del Monaco with the silver medal for singing the winning song from Luxembourg, Poupé de Cire, Poupé de Sang. And there is the writer, Serge Gainsbourg. And I trust that, as in the past, we shall have a reprise of the winning song. Well, I sing the song again, she says. Yes, she jolly well will. Now, walking to her position on the stage, which, as you can see, is quite a long way from the scoreboard, right to the other side of the stage. Oh, he's going to have a little run to get there. The floor manager, the Italian floor manager, with his headphones on behind. Hmm. But listen to the song once again. Wax doll singing star. Oh, 
Signore e signori, il nostro programma è così terminato. A tutti gli amici europei che ci hanno seguito questa sera, buonanotte. Notre programme est ainsi terminé. A tous les amis de l'Eurovision qui ont suivi notre émission, bonne nuit. Our program has come to the end. To all our friends in Europe that followed our show, good night. Well, that brings us to the end of this year's Eurovision Song Contest, won by Luxembourg, by, sung by France Girl, the song Poupée de Cire, Poupée de Sang. Luxembourg, you'll probably remember, won in 1961, and we were there in 1962 with Ronnie Carroll singing the song for Britain. Jassy Kirby came second with our song, and France came third. We always seem to come second, but right now, second or not, this is where I take my leave of you from the concert hall of the Rye Television Studio Centre in Naples. This is David Jacobs saying good night. <laughs>